looking for a mallet. Do you have one? Yes, of course, but it's mine. Would you please lend it to me? No, it's my mallet. Listen, I really need it. It's very important. I don't care. This is my mallet. Listen closely, Iru. I did what you asked me to do, remember? When I came back with your ink, you were no longer there. What I've got to do with that mallet is far beyond the understanding of a witless scribe. Just hand over your mallet with no further discussion. Understand? Here. Take it. Just don't hurt me. seems to be a papyrus. So here is the recipe for the remedy. If I manage to put it together, I'll save the inhabitants of Heliopolis. No need to waste time repairing the wall now. I've got to go and see the merchants. Hello. I'm looking for some olive oil. No, sorry, I, I don't have any. There's something else. for garlic. No, sorry, 
I don't have any. There's something else. I'm looking for some willow leaves. No, sorry, I don't have any. There's something else. I'm looking for some mandragore root. No, sorry, I don't have any. There's something else. I'm looking for beer. No, sorry, I don't have any. Are you interested in trading for this jewel? This jewel? Well, that is, uh, I feel like I was robbing you. Listen, I'll give you these dates, some linseed oil, lentils, and ten deadens of copper, and you give me the jewel, all right? All right. Thank you. I'm looking for some mandragore root. Mandragore? Yes, I've got mandragore roots. They're yours if you give me some linseed oil, or dates, whichever you prefer. All right, that's a good trade. There's something else. I'm looking for garlic. And it's your lucky day. I've got some. I'll give it to you in exchange for lentils. All right. That's a good trade. Sure. All right. That's a good trade. There's something else. I'm looking for the leaves of what is known as the fan tree. The fan tree, the fan tree. I seem to recall a merchant who had bought some from another merchant who had himself gotten it from a merchant from some country in the far, far east. Out there they call it the Bruko, or the Genko, something like that. And do you have some? It's a very, very rare substance. But should there be any at all in our city, I know the man you've got to see. It's just that... It's just that what? Listen, I've heard that you're a priestess of Sekhmet, and I've got a terrific bellyache. And diarrhea? Yes. Give me something to relieve this terrible pain. And I'll tell you where you can find the leaves you want. Ah, yes, I see what it is. I'll go to the temple storehouses and put together something that will soothe you. But when I get back, don't forget those leaves. Uh, of course. I'll be in the dead end next to Kuwait's stall. I don't want people to know I'm sick. It wouldn't be good for business.
for some willow leaves. I have willow leaves. I'll trade them to you for dates or beer. It's a deal. There's something else. I'm looking for some olive oil. Yes, I have olive oil. It comes from Biblos. I'll exchange it with you for 10 debons of copper. It's expensive, but it's excellent quality oil. It's a deal. You see, I only have this pot of honey, and I was keeping it for tonight. Iru, I need your honey. Ask for something in exchange. I'm not a thief. If you had some gold, that would certainly suit me.
thanks. You see, the honey is in the closet over there. There are not as many customers as usual. Huh, that's strange. Hello. I'm looking for beer. You want some beer? To take out, I gather. All right, but give me honey in exchange. Or some willow leaves. Thank you. Here's your beer. That's a stupid thing to do. Here, you let it sit overnight in the fresh air, and then you take some for four days in a row. Now, give me the fan tree leaves. Uh, you see, I don't actually have any. You must see the Nubian. If there's anyone in this town who's got a stock of rare or illegal items, he's the one. You can find him at the House of Beer. Thank you. 
called the Nubian. I think you've found him, honey. I was told that you could supply me with leaves from what people call the fan tree. Don't always believe what you're told. That stuff comes from a very far off land. Have a beer with me. But I don't want to drink. There's no buts about it. truth, I'm working for the temple. I just have to find those leaves. If you work for the temple, then you must know where to find them. You don't understand. It's a question of life or death. Heliopolis is threatened by a fatal disease. I know the cure, but I've got to have those leaves. You're the one who doesn't understand. You shouldn't believe everything people tell you. I'm an honest smuggler. The governor is the only person who can authorize trade and merchandise as rare as what you want. You have to ask him for the proper permit. Return with that and I'll see what I can do. I've got to see the governor. It can't be done. The governor told me, Pyre, this party is important for me. I don't want to be disturbed. So you'll have to come back another day. The survival of Heliopolis depends on it. Hold on there. Those are things I know nothing about. On the other hand, the governor's orders I understood perfectly. But I am here by order of the great seer of the Temple of Ray. I'm on an official mission to the governor. If the governor finds out you refuse to let me pass, it's not his palace you'll be guarding, but some deserted mine in the farthest reaches of the most desolate desert. Oh, uh, uh I don't understand anything about your stories. Pass, and figure out for yourself how to find the governor. see the governor right away. And I must go hunting right away. But since I have to guard this door, I'm not going just yet. You can't always do what you want, can you? You're a warrior, aren't you? Yes, that's my job. You look like a fine soldier to me. You must have had adventures in so many countries. Yes, and many doors to guard. <laughs> My whole life I've dreamed of meeting a warrior. My father told me stories with soldiers who were pitiless and fierce. I always imagined you perched proudly on your chariots, with lances firmly grasped in your fists, 
cutting bloody swaths through the enemy hordes. In fact, I never drove a chariot, but I know some battle stories. I could tell them to you if you came to my place tonight. What do you say? Listen, my husband is in there. Let me through. I could tell him that I wasn't going to see him tonight, and I'd come and listen to your stories. Hmm. I'll let you pass on one condition. You give me your word you'll come tonight. My word is equal to the reputation of our country's soldiers. Untarnished. I never lie. I'll come to you tonight if you let me pass. All right. This is a private party. You can't come in. I have to see the governor. It's very important. You can get an appointment tomorrow. Right now I have to find the musician, the one who plays the drum. You haven't seen her, have you? No, but I... She'd better show up. She must be sleeping it off somewhere. The musician. She's the one they're waiting for, so the party can begin. I swear, the things one has to do to save one's hometown. your instrument. Go into the ballroom and let's play for the governor. Where is he? None of your business. Just go in and play. Start over and respect the rhythm this time. I have no desire to wind up leading a band in some lost desert fortress.
I don't precisely know what music school you attended, young lady, but you've done very well. You may take a break and go have a drink. Are you the governor of Heliopolis? I do indeed hold that honor. My name is Noct. I am Tiffet. I need fan tree leaves, and I need your authorization to get them. The fan tree? I don't know that one. These leaves, just why do you need them? Heliopolis is in danger, Governor, in mortal danger. It's because of the wheat. The wheat? Uh, listen, wait for me in the room down that corridor over there. I'll just mix a bit with my guests and then I'll come see you. We've got to talk. You can't go in there. The governor himself told me to wait for him here. Let me through. <gasps> this is Hetep's report, and it says that the harvest has gone bad. What is it doing here? <clears throat> that report belongs to me. This is the granary inspector's report. The temple of raised wheat has gone bad. Whoever eats it is in danger. Oh, yes. Uh, the wheat. That wheat is poisoning the whole city. I know what has to be done, but I need the leaves I spoke to you about. The Nubian told me I needed your permission to be able to buy them from him. A Nubian? Your story is much too complicated, Tifet. We're having a party tonight. Come enjoy yourself with us. We'll discuss all this in the morning. What kind of governor are you, governor? Heliopolis is in danger, and this report warned you about it. Men and women are about to die, and you want me to party with you? You know what's happening, and yet you do nothing. Why? Appearances can be deceiving, young woman. You're a priestess of Sakhmet, aren't you? You must know, then, that things aren't always what they seem. For that matter, you can't know everything. Theban, bring us something to drink. I don't have time for a drink. Why does everyone want to make me drink? Do you think that anyone here asked you if you wanted something? are going to drink. Poison? You poisoned her! She's only been put to sleep. I respect your scruples, Governor. Hetep wasn't poisoned either. I hardly see what difference it makes, given his current condition, Theban. Don't blame Don't me blame for it all, for Governor. Governor. It's, it's your negligence, negligence alone, alone that created this situation. This situation. Things, would, Things have would have been different if you had read this report in time. time. But you prefer, but you prefer wine, wine and women. And women. That's why you're, you're dependent, dependent on my wealth. Well, well, well. I'm, in, I'm your in your power, power Theban. Theban. But if what but the if young, what the young woman, woman says, says is true, is true then the fate the of the fate city, of the is, city entirely is entirely in your hands. In your hands. I implore you. Say it, Heliopolis. You're in no position to ask anything of me. Get rid of the girl and come back to me. We've more work to do. And hide that report. A trepanation scar. This is the body of Hetep, the granary inspector.
it looked a lot stronger. Tiffet, I... I don't know how to tell you. You must be brave. Say what you have to say quickly. I've had a really tough night. Jehudi has passed away. I don't think he suffered. Oh no! Jehudi! No, 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 start over, and respect the rhythm this time. I have no desire to wind up leading a band in some lost desert fortress. No, 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 start over, and respect the rhythm this time. I have no desire to wind up leading a band in some lost desert fortress. No, 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 start over, and respect the rhythm this time. I have no desire to wind up leading a band in some lost desert fortress.
I don't precisely know what music school you attended, young lady, but you've done very well. You may take a break and go have a drink. Are you the governor of Heliopolis? I do indeed hold that honor. My name is Noct. I am Tiffet. I need fan tree leaves, and I need your authorization to get them. The fan tree? I don't know that one. These leaves, just why do you need them? Heliopolis is in danger, Governor, in mortal danger. It's because of the wheat. The wheat? Uh, listen, wait for me in the room down that corridor over there. I'll just mix a bit with my guests and then I'll come see you. We've got to talk. You can't go in there. The governor himself told me to wait for him here. Let me through. <gasps> this is Hetep's report, and it says that the harvest has gone bad. What is it doing here? <clears throat> that report belongs to me. This is the granary inspector's report. The temple of Ray's wheat has gone bad. Whoever eats it is in danger. Oh, yes. Uh, the wheat. That wheat is poisoning the whole city. I know what has to be done, but I need the leaves I spoke to you about. The Nubian told me I needed your permission to be able to buy them from him. A Nubian? Your story is much too complicated, Tifet. We're having a party tonight. Come enjoy yourself with us. We'll discuss all this in the morning. What kind of governor are you, governor? Heliopolis is in danger, and this report warned you about it. Men and women are about to die, and you want me to party with you? You know what's happening, and yet you do nothing. Why? Appearances can be deceiving, young woman. You're a priestess of Sakhmet, aren't you? You must know, then, that things aren't always what they seem. For that matter, you can't know everything. Theban, bring us something to drink. I don't have time for a drink. Why does everyone want to make me drink? Do you think that anyone here asked you if you wanted something? are going to drink. Poison? You poisoned her! She's only been put to sleep. I respect your scruples, Governor. Hetep wasn't poisoned either. I hardly see what difference it makes, given his current condition, Theban. Don't blame Don't me blame for it all, for Governor. Governor. It's, it's your negligence, negligence alone, alone that created this situation. situation. Things, Things would have been, would different, been different if you had read this report in time. time. But, you but you prefer wine, wine and, women. and women. That's why you're, you're dependent, dependent on my wealth. Well, well, well. I'm in I'm your power, power Theban. Theban. But if what but the if young, what the woman, young woman, says woman says is true, is true then the fate the of the fate city, of the is, city entirely is entirely in your hands. In your hands. I implore you. Say it, Heliopolis. You're in no position to ask anything of me. Get rid of the girl and come back to me. We've more work to do. And hide that report. A trepanation scar. This is the body of Hetep, the granary inspector.
It looked a lot stronger. Tiffet, I... I don't know how to tell you. You must be brave. Say what you have to say quickly. I've had a really tough night. Jehudi has passed away. I don't think he suffered. Oh no! Jehudi! I'm so sorry for you. Did... did he die of the disease you spoke to me about? Yes, there's no doubt of it. There's something else that's very disturbing. A dozen people died overnight. People are muttering about a prophecy. And to think that I had the impression no one believed me. If I had one piece of advice to give you, it would be to get out of this town. Quick! Flee! I'm going to stay. And I'm going to save the city. What do you stand to gain? Nothing. You know, Nubian, in our country, every individual has his place. And every individual does his duty in his place. That's how the world is made. And that's how it is ordered. I know that my place is here, and my duty is to save the city. That's all a mystery to me, but I'll help you anyway. I left the leaves you want in a bag downstairs. Don't ask questions, especially not where they came from. You've nothing to fear from me. The governor thinks I'm dead, and that's fine. I'm not running to his place to denounce you. There's someone waiting for you downstairs. I'll attend to your father. Thank you, Nubian. Tifet, I'm sorry about Jehudi. Maybe he wasn't a good doctor, but everybody loved him. Thank you. I know he liked you, too. What can I do for you? Over there is me. That's, uh, well, I like her a lot, and I, I think that she ate some wheat, like my parents did. Can you cure her? I am Tiffet. Do you want something? My name is Me. I think I'm sick. Me, tell me, have you eaten any bread? Yes, every day. No one told you that you mustn't? It's made with wheat that isn't healthy. No, nobody said anything. You've got the same disease as Jehuti. But there's nothing to worry about. Now I know the remedy. I'll treat you right away. 
you are going to be the first person in all of Heliopolis to be treated. The papyrus is very clear. I need exactly four doses of beer and not one more. I'm sure I'll get precisely what I want by pouring the beer carefully into these three jugs. Here, drink this. You seem to be feeling much better. Much better? I think I'm really all better. That means the treatment works. Very good, but don't wiggle about too much. I'm going to the temple to tell the great seer that the treatment is ready. Me is much better, thanks to you. It's like a parade. Everyone seems to have come to make offerings to Sakmet. Don't come back to me without the remedy, but I beg Great Seer, I have fulfilled my mission. The cure is ready. Here it is. I never doubted that you would manage, Tifet. I am going to give this remedy to the doctors of Heliopolis, and they will begin mass production of it. And I've just received a shipment of healthy wheat, so we don't risk famine. But you seem awfully sad for someone who's just saved an entire city. Jehuti is dead, Great Seer. Jehuti has undertaken his long journey to the West. He is on his way to a life that will last as long as the world does, Tifet. You can be proud of yourself, 
you can now think of carrying on with your own life. What are you going to do about the governor? Nothing. What do you mean, nothing? He drugged me, kidnapped me, and held me hostage. He's under the influence of a Theban, who's clearly got something in mind for your temple. And you're not going to do anything? A Theban, you say? I thought so. The governor didn't read the report that warned the city about the rotten wheat, and now he's trying to cover up his negligence. He placed the city in great danger. You know the rules of justice in this country as well as I do. Without evidence, a judge can do nothing, nor can I for that matter. If you had hard proof in front of you, would you do something then? With proof, the righteous man is acquitted and the guilty one punished. I'm going to find evidence of the governor's negligence. I must, to obey Mahat and in memory of Jehuti. I have to get into the governor's chambers. I have to bring back proof of his negligence. Hetep's report is just what I need. You should wait for nightfall. And I advise you to figure out a way to put the governor's geese to sleep. How do you know the governor has geese guarding his house? Once in a while, I have an urge for a snack, and grilled goose hits the spot. Nubians are really fearless, aren't they? True. In fact, things in general go better when Nubians are around. Haven't you noticed? I failed to get the governor punished. Thank you. 
Hey, there's someone there. Alert! Alert! And that's how I failed to get the governor punished. Is what I need. Thanks to Hetep's report, I'm going to get both the governor and the Theban convicted. Take the key. Hey, there's someone there. Alert! Alert! And that's how I failed to get the governor punished.
Now I can take the key. told me that if I brought you evidence of the governor's guilt, you'd have him sentenced. To start with, I'll open a judicial investigation. The gods trust me, and I trust them. If they want to see the governor convicted, they'll arrange for it to occur. I have Hetep's report, and I'm prepared to testify that I took it from the governor's bedroom. You sneaked into the governor's home and stole the report? Yes, that's what I did. His negligence could not remain unpunished. I've seen some odd things in my life. Some unknown young girl has one of the most powerful men in the country convicted? The gods must have willed it. You may not know it yet, Tifet, but you are a brilliant priestess. I predict a glowing future for you. I don't know, Great Seer. I just did what my heart dictated. I thank you, Tifet. And so does every one of the priests and scribes of this Temple of Ray. You have done a lot for us. Thus ends my story. The negligent governor was banished from the city, and the Temple of Ray escaped the control of the Theban priests. This legal judgment was very important for me, and for Jehudi's memory. But the most important thing was saving all those sick people. I was sad because I missed Jehudi. I shall keep my father's name alive, and I shall continue his work. As for the Nubian, we've got time for that, haven't we? And after all, I'm not really sure it's any of your business. In the dual country, we know that life holds many surprises for us. I was going to see Chihuti again soon, but that's another story.